Well, you know what? Um, he asked, like, did they know you? If the, if you come to the temple and you have one of the or you're just not going to go, they should let you in because that program that the prophet left is also a missionary program. But what you're saying is they acted like a private club, which is proof that they're a private club. And you don't gain your nationality out of a club or not. Right. It's interesting that you say that because that was really the vibe. Like, we're, we're joking about about how for you and that black people. We're joking about how um um the 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 temple vibe was like was like was like um the husbands escaping their wife night. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what that's spots for. Yeah, you know, that's what the spots for. It's the spots for you know what I mean? Okay, Sunday, Friday. Whatever like that, we can escape and then we're just gonna go to, and then be at the temple for eight hours and, and call that call that a night or whatever. But they they definitely are um, are on the other side just based on how how they dealt with us. And then, you know, that, that verifies everybody else who called, emailed, whatever like that and said that that's the response that they get when they go to these quote unquote reincarnated people and you know what I mean? All these other different branches of, of, of Moorish groups or whatever. That, you know, they, they, they stop you at the door. Yes. They give you the... Yes. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Try to, you know, it, it's, like, it's almost like, it's almost like if, if they are so for their people, for their nation, whatever like that, where they're at, like the temple, where, where the temple's at, is like oh, middle of the hood or whatever. Hood, straight hood. So they should not that, they, that building should be plastered with whatever, anything. Put anything on the building. To let anybody, you know what I mean, get some some things going on. You know what I mean? Like if it's white, they can use it for whatever. They can get the graffiti guy to come there and do something whatever. Right, right, they right. could they could get bootleg signs. It doesn't have to be anything crazy. It could be, you know what I mean? Some some easy sign. Just just something up there. Just so that people can have something to the reference not even happening because these individuals these individuals are, are literally working against what we're trying to do and the whole and, and the whole thing that we're supposed to try to do is, is waking up our people get our people into the mindset so that they know that this is not some club or cult or whatever come join up and whatever like that this is Put people out the information and then leave them alone. Let them go study. Really. Peace, man. I just wanted to say this real quick. Well, peace sounds a lot. Peace is all. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to say this real quick as your, as the brother Amazite was speaking. Uh, I know you're talking about a real life situation, but metaphorically, it was a piece in the matrix where he was talking about the gatekeeper and eventually somebody will have to fight them on. You know what I mean? So when he said that, I just wanted to add yeah, on yeah. that that was another message, yeah. if not a prophecy, and big acknowledgement to the sister who actually wrote that too. Yeah. That's right. all I wanted Love to say. Love 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 all right. Um, nationality is, is, or lack of nationality is the issue with, with our people. So this was also, um, this was also for for people who are in different territories to use um, Brother Amazite as an example. If there's somewhere where there isn't any activity or there's, um, you know, dirty more is there trying to, you know, stop the movement, that we take it on ourselves to do what has to get done. Because there, there, there's, you know, it's like what um, uh, what Onyx said. All we got is us. We ain't got anybody. As far as active mores, like we're it. You know what I mean? Um, as far as as a place to go study and learn or whatever like that. You know, you don't really need a temple because you got Army Bay publications you can go to. You really want to learn. You know what I mean? And and our our biggest fight is getting getting ourselves out of out of the, the um, you know thinking that 
Well, because I don't have uh, this and because I don't have that and because I don't have whatever, then I can't go out and teach our people. Or well, somebody, a grand chief has to tell me that I can go out and do whatever. When, if this is birthright, it's not about what somebody tells you to go do. If this is birthright, nobody's telling you when to blink, when to breathe, when to put on chapstick or whatever like that. You do that because this is what has to be done. You know what I mean? So everybody could, everybody can leave here knowing that when they get back to wherever they're at, right? You got, you got the quote unquote storefront products in the back, right? That you can, you can build with them and they'll let you know. Well, you know, there's how much they are or whatever like that. If you want to get a box of them, whatever, so you can have it where you're at and then you move them where you're at to get the word out. They got um, the whole t-shirt, t-shirt thing, check what the connections are, how much it costs, and let it happen, and then make it happen. Start, remember, um, even though the, the appearance is that system's crashing, system didn't crash. So all this stuff that we got, you know, holding on to credit cards and holding on to 401k and holding on to all this stuff that we can liquidate tomorrow, get some finance and do something with, right? Should be doing that. Because, you know, I was talking with, um, t today they're having um, this Pan-African gala back in Toronto. And um, one of the brothers had contacted me and said, you know, um, um, you know, some of the people who are, who are, who are running it, you know, they want to get, they want to get some finance as soon as possible so that they can, you know, pay the vendor and pay the whatever and pay the whoever. I was telling them, yo, tell them liquidate their little credit stuff that they got holding on to. Don't hold on to, don't hold on to the debt to go, to think that you do, well, you know, we're doing conscious stuff, so we're not gonna leave the debt, we're gonna leave the debt, we're gonna do conscious stuff, right? But you're holding on to the debt. You're not relinquishing, you know what I mean? You're, you're still holding on to it. So that's not, Quite, that's not quite cognizant that you know that that's debt. You know that it, it, the purpose of it is for you to, you know, get some, do something with it. Especially at this time, you know what I mean. Get it, do something with it. Do something with it. They got other people out there telling me, "Hey, bring me your gold, and I'm gonna give you fiat." And people are gonna go do that. Do the reverse. Take that fiat, go buy some dinar or something like that. Take the fiat, go buy some whatever, anything. You know what I mean? Find some, find some more who's doing stuff. Give it to them, let them do something with it. Once you know that they're doing something proper with it. But everybody has a obligation that once they come to the level of I'm not Negro, black color, you know that that you got us as a corporation or whatever like that, you got obligation to tell people. Have to. You can't not say anything. Better you say something and then they this. At least now you can say, okay, you know, at least I tried or whatever. Then say nothing. And then not knowing. Because it's just like like with the little brothers. You know what I mean? Like, they could have passed us straight, we could have passed them straight, and it wouldn't have been anything. And then that turned into a little bill with them actually being receptive. And then we have the situation with um, the elder that go to him and we were talking to him for a half hour and we we, we we're just <laughs> and he's not getting it. Right. He's not getting it. Nothing's going through. Like nothing's going through. You know I'm talking about anything. Whatever. Nothing's going through. <clears throat> Block of wood. The whole time. Right? So that was one where, you know, we you know we we'll take the we we'll take the loss. You know what I mean? Waste a little time dealing with that guy. We should have Five minutes in, we should have been like, you know, right, 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 yeah. <laughs> just like, just like the, the, the brother at the bagel shop. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> right. Yeah. He, oh. Right. My goodness, man. We, they had this brother, right? So he just standing on the corner. We, we get something to eat, you know, get dressed or whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, and uh, I say, hey, how you doing? I'm Amazon. I say, hey, how you doing? I say, you got, some, you doing something today? <laughs> no. Say, look, brother, we got a lecture. Oh, I do. I got to go see my kids. 
Yo, kid, yo, I said so. You, you just told me you wasn't doing that home. You for real? You telling me that? You really took what you're gone. I'm like, nah, come on. So I'm walking and talking and all that. I'm like, breaking this stuff down. I'm like, yeah. So I gave him the fly. I don't see the brother. <laughs> you feel me? But I was trying to get a brother my experience with birthright. Now that's not the sending right there. That's Junior Soldier Bay. I'm going to show you this medical under Junior Soldier Bay and Amazon and Mother's Bay. Now this ain't a privilege. This is a right. Now it is colorblind culture because we're under colonization. But the principle is I got it under my free national. So I'm going to just pass this around. <coughs> you saw history. That's his report card. That's my assembly. So that's proof that nationality is feasible, appliable, and applied knowledge. Not just you hearing these brothers and sisters and myself on the internet in our mouth. So I'm putting my person on the record for the nation and say prove it wrong. That's the facts. And that's a problem that we don't know that. Also, I'm going to pass this around. So-called Pittsburgh. Now, on RV Bay Publication is a House Jerk Revolution 75, right? If you don't know what that is, I'm going to let y'all see this. This was put on the record in 1933, and it's basically telling you the Moorish American society. So they say, excuse me, who the? Thank you. How's your revolution? 75? 75. 75. No, it's just not one, nine, two. No, 75. 75. Okay, so the reason why I'm bringing it up, it's on the site. Okay, so, oh, it's on the internet. We don't believe it. Okay, I went to the law library. To back up what RV Bay has on the site, I went to the so-called Pittsburgh Law Library. This is the physical copy. It exists. So when people say we're not Moors, it's already on the record. And this is to put a free website, which really is a university, to learn about our birthright and nationality for free. So Moors, we like to double check and check. This is on our website, and I went to the law library. This is what she has on the library, and I think the system needs to be commended. You follow me? So if anybody talk bad about that system, I just proved it on camera to be a goddamn lie. Facts. There's a, there's a bunch of other resolutions on there, too, oh, that yeah. many people didn't, didn't know about, only because you've never been told. Right. One from Washington, D.C., like 2000 and something. Uh, there's a whole, all of them are there, on there that I know of, and then I'm not talking about the recent ones right. that happened after 212, where it just yeah, went, yeah, yeah. you know, right. Moorish American Day. These you're talking about, those are in there, historical uh -huh. records for certain, on right. the record. But there are, when we went to put those up, we found that there were others also that had not, that we had not had knowledge of, so I put them all up there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, when anybody because you as y'all get into this information these groups of people that you run into they the renegade more rv bay this Ujo that amazon this me is this set right bay this you're gonna hear that we just come in and present the facts and you do what you want to it, but we live birth fight every day all day long good question uh, majority they 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 newly awakened ones well some of them are some of them not so I'm just presenting the facts to them and then we're going to, you know. But we can find out, though. That's a good question. Though. Only the reason I say that is just because what you're doing is great. Because a lot of times people need to be shown. You can tell them all that, all right. but you need to show, right? So I go to the airport in Philly, and I get on the airplane with my nationality. Right? right? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh. Brother, brother, I, I really got to get that on tape. I really, because I just had, oh my goodness. Oh, did did y'all hear that? Problem. We just had that conversation. Forgive me, brother. Get, for, forgive me, brother. I, I really, forgive me, brother. Oh my goodness. And hey, you didn't have no problem. I mean, uh, you're going to get it, because I got yeah. people who've asked. And they say, well, I can't tell you what to do until you go try it. I you go what do it. And when you do it, then you'll know for sure. So the brother went and did it, and he yeah. says, oh my God, it worked. I'm like, yeah. yeah, you applied it.